ever has tried a former president in modern world for using the right to pardon. That's, uh, that's I mean, it's, it's without precedent. Uh, but uh, but I think there is wider implication this decision. What we see here is the joint efforts by Ukrainian and Georgian oligarchs. And uh, well, President Poroshenko went to Tbilisi last summer since he got my huge problem in Ukraine because he thinks that um, I'm his main problem among politicians here. And he asked them to speed up cases against me. And that's when they uh, came up with this case, uh, sped it up. And uh, when today they, I was sentenced there, and then immediately Ukrainians said, well, that's a basis for uh, extradition because before the Ukrainian prosecutor general, uh, until I went to opposition here, uh, they were saying that every case against me in Georgia is political. Now we have a sentence, so Ukrainians can change their tune. So I think it's a result of joint political deal between the oligarchs uh, in Ukraine and Georgia, between Ivanishvili and Poroshenko. They had a meeting last July in, in, in Batumi, and they discussed this issue. Uh, but also, strangely, it's also uh, actively encouraged by Vladimir Putin at his uh, previous press conference in December. He mentioned my name at least 12 times, and 12 times he was calling on uh, Georgian and Ukrainian authorities to deal with me and to take basically to uh, crack down.